Hey guys, we are back on my channel and we are here with another banger, banger, banger. And today we're gonna gonna be playing FM20 Mobile with Arsenal. As as you can see, Arsenal have appointed Manny plays as manager. Mhm. Mm I am the new manager. Let's change this. Um. Wait, let me check the staff first. Oh, pretty good. Not so bad. Not too bad. Not too shabby. Um, I'll give that to him. Takes controls of. Okay, for the first one, we're gonna watch together. Then we're gonna um. So yeah. Uh, we've got one hundred twenty-five million to spend. Let me just change that real quick. And as you guys can see, we have 200 million to spend. Oh, jeez, bro. We we are going to spend almost all of that. Because you already know FM20 Mobile, you can just spend all your money just like that. In a snap of a finger. Um, Screenier. Uh, we're going to need a couple center backs. European qualification. Yeah, I think that's fair. Uh, our first games, Newcastle, Norwich, Southampton, all games we should win. Um, what should be our tactics? Uh, I'm gonna play a bombing up front. Because I don't think Lacazette has been up to his standards, um, since he was at Lyon. You know, um, his performances have dropped. And yeah, I just think he hasn't been good enough. So he's gonna be our super sub, I guess. Uh, let's start Lucas Torreira and Granit Xhaka. Uh, he's not he, as y'all know, you um, he had a falling out with the Arsenal fans, and but he's still he he's still at Arsenal, um, because of Mikel Arteta. So yeah, he saved. Granit Xhaka's um, Arsenal career. Uh, Hector Bellerin. Uh, who else? You know, this Arsenal squad, it really needs a rebuild. That's why I decided to help them out today. And, yeah. Uh, let's go attacking wide, fast, expressive. Um, we're going to go high... Um, all over. Actually, let's put that. Committed. Uh, look for overlap. Work into box. Through balls. Mixed, mixed, mixed. Um, our penalty takers. Our penalty takers are gonna be a bombing Lacazette, Martinelli, um, Pepe, Granit Xhaka, uh, Torreira. Uh, Meza Uzul and Saka. Free kick takers. Let's put Pepe, um, Uzil, Jaka, and I guess Torreira. Corner takers. Okay. You know, Saka is a pretty good crosser. I'm not gonna lie. When I've watched him play, um, Tierney. Uh, who else? Hmm. Let's go with Reese Nelson, I guess. Uh, Uzo. And let's go to our captain. Uh, I think what Arsenal are lacking, they're lacking a leader. So I'm gonna buy a leader in the dressing room for Arsenal. Well, at least I'm gonna attempt to. But we have two hundred million, so I think we'll be all right. Uh, Matty. Uh, Aubameyang, Socrates, uh, Xhaka, Tierney, who's the captain at Celtic, so, yeah, I think we'll be fine. Uh, let's go on to our transfer targets, finally. Um, what do we need first? Let's get a center back. That's the number one priority right now. Um... 
Should we get a right footed or uh let's send a center back that has leadership quality. Um so yeah. Uh, who should we buy? Uh this is hard. There's not a lot of great options, but there's some decent options. So the first player we're going to go in for is Ruben Diaz. Quality center back. I'm um, going to be a pretty good center back in the future. And yeah, let's let's just see if we can buy him. And also he's a leader. What? Who? <sighs> it's Letico Madrid. Do not get in a bidding war with us, please. We have 200 million in the transfer budget. 40 million, they couldn't even match it. Okay, let's go and negotiate with... <gasps> no! No way. Okay. So we're gonna have to go in for someone else. Uh... Who should it be? I don't even know. Bonucci? Should we go in for him? Yeah, let's go in for him. Uh, he's a good center back. Um, and he, that was pretty cheap. I mean, he is 32, but still. I think he's a good enough center back. Um, to start in for us, especially Arsenal, you know, because, ah, their center backs, like, Mustafi, Dava Luiz, most memeable center backs right now. I'm sorry. Um, who else should we go in for? Uh, let's go in for maybe a midfielder. Uh, yeah. So, let's go in for Saul. Um, good center midfielder for, um, Atletico Madrid. So, they, come on, lower the price a little bit, come on. What? Bro, come on, come on, come on. Let's get this deal done, come on. Lower your price, lower your price. 80 million. Let's agree. 90 million. Should we really do it? He's so versatile. I have to. I have to. I have to. Um, who else? Milinkovic Savage? Yeah, let's go in. Let's get, go in for him. Uh, he's gonna be hard to buy. Like I've always tried to buy him, and he's extremely hard to buy. Like, oh. I don't even think I've ever actually successfully bought him from Lazio. They are hard negotiators. Um, with him, just in general in this game, they're hard negotiators. One thirty-five million. We might not go through with that, but we'll see. Uh, I think for this season, we don't need too many signings, uh, because we only need to get the Champions League, and I think this squad is a really decent squad, and they should be able to get the Champions League. Maybe we should buy, like, a couple more center backs, because up front, I think they're good enough. Kula Bali, he's been linked with Liverpool, Manchester City. Um, United in the past, but let's try and get him ourselves. So let's see, Napoli. What do you want for Kulaba? Whoa! They just outright rejected it. They said they did not want to talk anymore. They did not want to talk. Jose Jimenez. Let's go in for it. No, I didn't. I've looked at him in the future in FM and he doesn't turn out to be that good so yeah uh should we go for the light I mean he's versatile and he's 
a wonder kid no 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 not for that money that's too much that is too much let's look at other options um who else is here okay we got we got a deal done with bournemouth for um nathan ake 40 million plus 50 percent sell-on clause so yeah uh let's see if we can give them contracts and yeah let's just go Kula Bali just signed for Barcelona. Great. Just great. Great news. Great news. Uh let's give him four years. Um, what's his contract right now? Uh let's give him one eighty thousand and then four million signing on fee. Okay. Uh Let's lower that to 190, then lower that to 4 million again. Uh, what's he unhappy with? Okay. Uh, we should get this deal done. And we have, so, Leonardo Bonucci should be coming to Arsenal very soon. Uh, Saul now, let's try and get him. Uh, okay. Okay, he wants a lot of money, a lot. Let's lower that to two thirty, um, four point eight. Oh wait, okay. Yeah, let's just accept it. Milinkovic Savage. Uh, five mil keep first team. Um, exit. Okay, this. 300,000. Let's lower that. Let's give him like 225. I think that's fair. 5.5. Finalized deal. Nathan Nake. Uh, let's give him first team. Uh, okay. 120,000. Okay. Let's give him 150 then. First team, through mill. Still hasn't accepted it for some reason, which I don't know why, but uh, we're going to get this deal done no matter what. And we have. So let's see which players we're going to bring in. Um, Leonardo Banucci is coming to Arsenal. Let's go, boys. Our first signing of the era of Manny plays. Um, what number should we give him? He wants 19. That's tough. We're going to have to give him 4. Because Pepe already has 19. Sorry, Bonucci. You can't have 19. Um, let's skip this one. Saul. Coming to Arsenal. Let's go Baby, well, how much money do we have left? Oh, jeez, 124. Uh, which is more important? I think Nathan Ake or Malinkovic Savage. If we sign Malinkovic Savage right now, this is the transfer window for us is over. And if we sign Nathan Ake, we improve our defense. And he's pretty versatile too. But Malinkovic Savage is a quality player and he's pretty versatile too. This is so hard. You know what? Let's sign Nathan Ake. We're going to sign Malinkovic Savage next season. So, let's go. Nathan Ake. Uh, whoever that is. Um, okay. Saul. Let's give him number eight. He's gonna be our midfield maestro. Um, and then Nathan Ake. Let's just give him... Um, let's not give him a number yet. Because we have some um players that we need to sell. 
Okay, first, who should we sell? Oh, I know a lot of people are gonna love this. Bye, David Louise. Bye bye. See you later. Um, who else? Rob Holding. What's his potential? Doesn't really have potential. Uh, this is hard to evaluate because. Uh, I think we should keep Callum Chambers for now. But he's eventually probably going to get sold. Maybe next season or two seasons from now. Um, Where's Mustafa? Oh, he's in the starting lineup. Ugh. Uh, yeah, let's sell um, both of them. So yeah, let's let's offer him to clubs. Fifteen million. I think that's a fair enough. Um Mustafi's been better this season, but I think he should just be gone by now. I don't think he's Arsenal qu Arsenal quality. Then eight million. Um couple of inquiries. Okay. So yeah. Let's see if we can get enough money. Um to buy some more players. But we might not even need to buy more players. I think we're right now pretty good in a good situation. Uh, maybe we should buy a cam. Yeah, let's go buy a cam. Um, Who should we buy? James Rodriguez. Hmm. Okay. And we... Are going to sign Kai Havertz. Oh my gosh. For 69 million. There was like two clubs. I think one of them was Everton. If I'm not mistaken. But we won the bidding war. And for 69 million. I think we've got him on the cheap. Because um, they were saying like 103 million before. We were in a bidding war. So yeah I think that's good. Um, so what should we offer him in the wages? Um, let's go for one fifty thousand. Um, three mil. Not too bad. Uh, what do we offer him? Okay. Let's go one eighty thousand. Three point three million. Still no. Okay. Okay, let's go. Let's finalize this deal. I know a lot of Arsenal fans will be happy to see this deal go through. And the fans are very happy that Saul is signed by us. Okay. Let's try and get $16 million from Watford, please. Okay. $9 mil. Nine point. No, 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 no. And he rejected. Oh, I messed up. I messed up. That's my bad. Um, let's um, let's skip this game because we haven't gotten Kai Havertz in yet. And we utterly demolished Derby six to two. Aubameyang got four goals, and Gabriel Martinelli got a brace. Let's go, baby. And next, we're going to be facing Torino um, in Kai Havertz deal. Don Kai Havertz is officially an Arsenal player. Um, Let's get that. Um, oh, I can't even believe what's going on. Um, He's going to take Mr. Uzo's number for sure, for sure. Um, uh... Find the mentor. Yeah, I was going to say Uzo because we all know Uzo is a great passer and he has great vision. So I think he should be able to mentor Kai Havertz. So, um, Torino's in eight days. I can't, I still can't believe I messed up the Mustafi and Devil Louise deals, but. Um, let's see what we can get for them again. Oh. And, uh, yeah. Okay.
Okay. So, yeah. Devil Louise, let's try and offer him to clubs too. Uh, okay. What? From where? Bro. Uh, what? Am I tripping? Bro, they rejected the deal. They said no. Oh. They're here again. Let's just accept. I don't care anymore. No. He rejected all of them. I'm lit. Bro. If he's not going to leave, he's going to stay, I guess. I was thinking about releasing him, but if you guys want me to release him, let me do let me know down below in the Let's go. David Louise is injured. Oh my gosh. Uh That's what you get for not leaving us. We're injury FC. Let's go, baby. Oh wait, 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 wait. Okay, good. Um Manager options. Okay. Uh, Torino. About to get utterly demolished. Demolished. I'm telling you. Look at the signings we made. Oh my gosh. This is like out of this world signings. Um. Okay. Saul is gonna go into. Where is Saul? Oh, he's already in there. Um, Kai Havertz, Torera, Torera. Uh, where, where's Bella? You're starting Sedge. Okay, I mean I know it's preseason. Okay, so Tierney. Um. Okay, um, if you guys hear any, um, sounds in the background, I'm sorry for that because it's my sister and she just won't be quiet even though I'm telling her to be quiet a ton of times, but it hey, whatever, you know. Um, let's put... She's just being annoying, that's why she's making noise, but... Okay. A defense playmaker. So I'm finished with that. Let's get right into the game. Okay, let's choose what number we should give him. 22. Let's go right into this game. Let's proceed. Anyways. So we are playing Torino and the game has started. Okay, Tierney passes it to Saka. Ooh, ball into the box. Belot Belotti. Okay, so, oh, they've got a corner. What can they produce from it? Nothing. Um, Aina, the Nigerian international, put a ball into the box, but nothing happened. Pepe, Nicolas Pepe, puts the, bo the ball back into the back of the net. Let's go. Bellerin, look at that. Into the box for Pepe. Uh, and that should be the half over. You know, let's make this more exciting. So let's put that at overlord, overload. And this is just preseason, so it doesn't matter whether we lose or win. So yeah, or draw doesn't matter. Um, okay. So let's go into the second half. Let's see what happens. Bellerin, Torreira, Saul, Abamyang. Goalkeeper saved it. Bellerin puts the ball into the box, but Surugu clears the ball. Running down the wing, and that'll be a corner for Torino. This could be dangerous. Okay, nothing, nothing. Clear the ball, clear the ball. Good, good, good. Okay. Bolotti got his ye got a yellow card. So far, only the Nicolas Pepe um goal is all we've seen from the two sides, and Torino gets a injury. 
okay? Tyranny. Saka. Pepe, no, it's a corner. We were close. We were close. Come on, Saka. Put in a good ball. Nope. Goal kick for Torino. Oh, no. 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 Okay, good. He's joining the attack for a preseason game. What? Their goalkeeper. <gasps> a bombing. No, he deflected it. Leno picks up the loose ball. A bombing got a melt uh, out muscled. Um, the game should be over. Okay. Come on, end the game, ref. Okay. Okay, come on, come on. No, clear the ball. Okay, clears the ball to... It's all over. Arsenal beats Torino. And it wasn't that exciting. Only a couple of chances. And yeah, we won 1-0. So... If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe, and share. Um, tell me in the comments below um, what you thought of this episode. Tell me if you would like more so I can continue this series. And also, tell me if you guys have any suggestions for tactics for this Arsenal side. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out.